Two 20-year-olds charged an alleged $1.1 million NFT scam. The duo were charged with wire fraud and conspiracy to commit money laundering for allegedly selling bogus NFTs to investors before abandoning the project, shutting down their website, and absconding with $1.1 million in digital funds. Which, the reason why this is such a big deal, like why this article is such a big deal, there are so many, in quotes, influencers that are promoting NFTs and then basically rug-pulling people, meaning basically just taking all of their money and scamming them. So they took the virtual money and ran. Prosecutors in New York's Southern District Thursday charged two 20-year-olds in connection with an alleged NFT scam. Ethan Van Nguyen and Andre Marcus Quedayon Lacuna were charged with wire fraud and conspiracy to commit money laundering for allegedly selling bogus NFTs to investors before abandoning the project, shutting down their website and absconding with $1.1 million in digital funds. NFTs, or non fungible tokens, are digital assets supposedly made unique and therefore scarce or scarce through blockchain, through blockchain technology, and in recent years, NFTs have fueled a boom in sales of digital art. The turning market in demand for NFT investments has not only drawn the attention of real artists but scam artists as well homeland security investigation special agent in charge Ricky patel said in a statement the arrested thieves allegedly hid behind online ad- identities where they promised investors rewards giveaways and exclusive opportunities before implementing their rug pull scheme leaving investors with empty pockets and no legitimate investment Prosecutors say the pair had pulled up stakes on their so-called Frosty series of NFTs, deleting the website and transferring the $1.1 million across several virtual wallets within hours of selling out the digital tokens. Nujin and Lukuna were planning to repeat the digital fly-by-night act with a March 26 NFT drop called Embers, prosecutors said, and the pair faced up to 20 years in prison and convicted. If convicted, 20 years in prison. Okay? Think about this. And, like, this is not a small thing, right? This means, like, influencers like uh, Ice Poseidon, like, potentially Floyd Mayweather. Potentially, Lana Rhodes, the former, well, I think she's still technically an adult actress or whatever you call it. Like, there's a lot of influencers out there that are promoting things and basically just trying to constantly scam people. Like, it's it's really crazy when you really think about it. So just be safe out there. If you want to learn how to get out of debt, go to 40inbox.com.